Cyclones, also known as hurricanes or typhoons, are formidable weather phenomena characterized by their immense power and strong destructive force. But how do these mighty storms come into existence? Now that's where the physics comes to play. We all know that the earth is rotating and the rotation of earth causes the Coriolis effect. We all know that the air ka jo flow will always be in high pressure region and low pressure region. Ki taraf in northern hemisphere, when the air is moving from high pressure region to low pressure region, it slightly gets deviated towards the right due to Coriolis effect and in the southern hemisphere, it slightly gets deviated towards the left. And we get that swirling motion air. Ka. Now, according to Bernoulli's principle, when the speed of air increases, the pressure decreases. Ye cyclone ke case mein hume dekhne ko milta hai just above the surface of ocean. Jaha pe, when air gets warmer, it expands and moves upward. Ab yaha pe void reh gaya. Is void ko fill karne ke liye, aas paas ki saari hawa andar ki taraf aati hai, high speed se. Aur agar yaha pe Coriolis effect kaam kar gaya, so we see a cyclone.